you know, obviously I'm not going anywhere and I haven't done anything wrong. That's Representative Will Dismukes responding to calls from state Democrats for him to step down. The Alabama Democratic Party says they want the Republican state rep to resign over his public support for Confederate monuments. Tonight's state Capitol reporter Rashad Hudson speaking with the two people engaged in debate. Representative Will Dismukes of Prattville says he has no plans to resign. Meanwhile, on the issue of Confederate monuments, Democrats are calling him short-sighted and stuck in the past. The Alabama Democratic Party sent out this photo of Representative Will Dismukes and his family at Confederate Flag Day in 2019. You can wrap yourself in the Confederate flag on Saturday and then go to the State House on Monday and represent all Alabamians and try and make this a better state for everyone. The party's executive director, Perry Wade, blasted Dismukes for his support for the Confederacy. He's never realized how, how hurtful the symbols uh, and that history is to, uh, to a lot of Alabamians. Last week, Representative Anthony Daniels called for the state to stop using taxpayer money to fund the Confederate Memorial Park. Dismukes fired back saying he would work to protect that funding. That I don't stand for slavery in any shape, form or fashion. And uh, you know, I think it's certainly a black eye in many, many aspects. But because I want to protect our history doesn't mean that I'm all of a sudden glorifying the days of slavery or anything of that nature. I asked Representative Will Dismukes, could he understand why this could be offensive to some people? If we really look at our country as a whole, there's a lot of things in our past that aren't pleasant, but we can't just start wiping it out and, and erasing it all because it makes us uncomfortable. When asked, could there be a compromise when it comes to Confederate monuments in the state, neither side doesn't believe so at this time. Reporting in Montgomery, Rashad Hudson, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.